Here we see the rare Justin Lee failed deadlift, we might not get to witness one of these for another decade or so. And no, that's not me beating my meat, but me giving you a hand of applause, because you, my friend, are on point with this comment. You see, the biggest misconception with strength training is that you have to train to failure or very close to failure, at failure, near failure, no pain, no gain. If you're grinding failing reps, that's progress. Yeah. Depends what stage of lifting you're at. The stronger you get, the more careful you have to be with the recovery. And so going to failure every single session, like maxing out every session, in the long run will do more damage than good. And in my case, my recent deadlift, I wanted to test my deadlift to see where I was at prior to gym's reopening, as I've been off program for quite a while due to inconsistent training. But yeah, the game plan is not to fail many deadlifts, in the near future at least, so I can rebuild up momentum in training, reduce the likelihood of getting injured, and improving upon where I left.